Next talk will be by Marcos Goetz, and he will talk to you about a, a backtrace browsing tool. Hello. Okay, hey, welcome. So I'm going to talk about paste.wobok.org, which is a code paste for C++ symbols. You might wonder why would you need that? So the scenario here is someone sends you a backtrace. For example, your colleague, your customer, or you see it in your internal external bug tracker, and you want to quickly learn more about this backtrace. So let's just take this scenario. I'm going to take a crash here from, from Qt Creator. I have a backtrace here. Oh, well, looks big. OK, how can I learn about this? Just select it. Do you see enough? Yeah, I guess it's fine. Copy it in here. Yeah, the internet is a bit slow. Okay, what can what can what do I have here? I have I have tooltips, automatic tooltips. I see here ah there's a QBAT alloc. I can directly go into the code here of this bad alloc. I see here ah, it's in it's in QString realloc data, so I can go in here, which goes to the Wobok code browser on code.wobok.org. So I can browse the code here, hmm, what is going on? Who is calling this QBAT alloc? See here. Ah, it's, it's from this uh, macro here. So the data allocate returned zero. Can go in more. Yeah, who is? So this was in QString. Uh huh, okay, okay. So it was here from my fake Vim handler and Qt creator. So I can also go to the definition of this and look what is going on here, for example. Can look at my M buffer, which is a member variable here, and then go here to the symbol inspector to get more info about this. How does this work? So it's a client side JavaScript that is augmented on a code, uh, code paster that I got from, from GitHub. So it recognizes possible C, C symbols. So it uh, doesn't, of course, know if it is a C, C++ symbol, but it does an XML HTTP request to our API to get some information about it. How does this look like? It's just a URL. You can, you can try this here. Is it too small? Yeah. You can try this, try this yourself. This, uh, fixed URL, and then you just append a symbol name. Then on the server side, we go through the index files uh, generated by our code browser. So, so this is not a, 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 live, a live browser. It's uh, pre-generated index files and pre-generated HTML files. The generator is based on libclung, and it analyzes your AST and generates uh, data files from it. So currently, we're hosting the source of uh, Qt, KDE, Clang, GCC, Boost, and some others. If you want to try this yourself, you can just go on paste.wobok.org and paste anything you want. Or you can learn more about the code browser on code.wobok.org if you want to use it for your own projects. If you want to embed this, this, uh, this JavaScript on your own sites, just send me an email and I can help you. Thank you.